Hi! In this tutorial, we'll look at the step-by-step -step Amelia booking wizard. First things first, let's see how we can add the step-by-step -step booking view to one of your website's pages. Simply click on the Pages option in the WordPress admin panel. Then, click on the Add New link. Here, you will see the Insert Shortcode button in your tiny MCE editor. When you will click on this button, the Amelia booking widget will automatically open. Here, you need to select the Booking option from the drop-down menu and click OK. After you are done with this, click on Publish. In case you cannot find the shortcode button, don't worry. You can always use the bracket Amelia Booking bracket shortcode. Simply insert this shortcode into the page and click Publish. Now, what will your customers see? They will be presented with the choice of a service, a location, and an employee, if there are multiple options of each. Then, depending on the chosen service, two new options might appear. Add extra and bringing anyone with you? You have to keep in mind that these two options can only appear if the system is configured to enable them. In case your customer chooses to add an extra, he or she will be offered to select the extra and the extra quantity. Depending on the chosen extra option, the system will edit the slots that were free. It will also modify the service price accordingly, if the extra is not free. What about the other option? Bringing anyone with you? That's designed for customers who wish to take their friends or relatives to the appointment as well. In this case, they do not need to enter the information for these people. After they are done with these options, they will see a Continue button. By clicking on it, they will be taken to the next step of the booking process. During the second step of the Amelia booking process, your customers will see a calendar. Here, they can choose a preferred date from the available days for their appointment. Once they make a choice, the system will present them with the available time slots. After they choose their preferred time slot, they will see a Continue button. By clicking on it, they will proceed to the third step of the Amelia Booking Wizard. The third step is when your customer provides all the necessary data to complete the process. The system collects the personal information about your customer. Afterward, he or she is presented with a choice of the payment method. You can find out more about Amelia's payment methods in the corresponding documentation page. During this step, they also can add a coupon if they have one. Finally, they can confirm the accuracy of the information about the appointment. If he or she chooses to pay via PayPal, the PayPal module will appear as the next step. If your customer selects another payment method, the system will process the payment through that option. Then, your customer will receive the confirmation email. At the same time, the appointment will be added to the system. Finally, the customer will be taken to the last step of the booking process. Your customers are offered to add their appointment to the calendar of their choice. They can choose from four options. These include Google Calendar, Yahoo Calendar, iCal, and Outlook Calendar. You can also turn off this feature if you feel that there are too many steps in the process. Thank you for checking out this tutorial. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. Make sure to check out these other tutorials we've created for the Amelia Appointment Booking plugin. And if you're enjoying the plugin, please share your experiences with it through your social networks. It will help us add new and cool features to the plugin.